Oh, boys, and just like that, I finished school for the whole entire day. I cannot wait to go home and chillax. Oh, hey, speaker man. Funny seeing you here. Oh, uh, hey there. Hey, uh, I got a question. Oh, okay, yeah. What's your question? Uh, I've been wanting for a long time. Can we get married? Wait, what? Can we get married? No. What? Why not? Well, because I barely even know you. Am I not pretty enough? Uh, honestly, you're just pretty weird. You're like a crazy fangirl. Uh, yeah, I would call myself a fangirl. Look, I put you on my shirt. Hey, yo, what? I'm on your shirt? Yes, it says, I love Speaker Man. What the heck? Oh, my gosh. Okay, well, I'm getting out of here. See ya. Guys, that crazy fat girl is insane. She literally wants to marry me. Well, I'm just going to head back home, and I'm just going to chill out. And hopefully, she doesn't come back. And uh, I'm back in my house. I cannot wait to go upstairs so I can just chillax. Hello? Is anyone home? Wait a second. I think I heard that voice before. Who is that? Oh, my gosh. It is my crazy fat girl. Hello? Open up. Wait a second, guys. What's that sign say? I think it said, Speaker Man, I love you. What the heck? Guys, I barely even know this girl. She already loves me, and she wants to marry me for some reason. Speaker Man, I know you're in there. Then the power of love is going to break down your door. What the heck? The power of love just broke down my door? Uh-oh. Speaker Man, where are you? I love you. Guys, how did she not see me? Okay, okay. This is super duper bad. I got to do something about her. Uh, Here, I'm going to approach her. Uh, hey there, girl. What are you doing in my house? Oh, my gosh. Man. Hey, uh, what are you doing here? I came to say I love you. Oh, my gosh. Well, again, I do not love you. I barely even know who you are. Well, could you just try to get to know me and give me a chance? Nope, I'm not going to do that. Come on, please. What the heck? Why are you upset? Okay, yo, honestly, just get out of the house already. I just want you to love it. All right, see ya. And hopefully that is the last of her because she is super duper crazy. And I cannot believe that she just came to my house to hold up a love me sign. Hello. Open up. Wait, what? No way. She's back. Crazy fangirl, what are you doing here right now? I have something I would like to sell to you. What? Sell to me? Okay, what is it? It's a special drink I made. It's so yummy. Please take it. A special drink that's pink. Okay, that is kind of suspicious. No, it tastes like strawberry. Okay, honestly, crazy fangirl, what is inside of that drink? Nothing is inside of the drink. Just love and strawberry. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that a love potion? What? No, I mean, uh, maybe. What the heck? Okay, crazy fangirl, get out right now. Take the love potion. No. Oh, get out right now. Or I'm going to call the police on you. Please take the love potion. I took so long to make it. Nope, nope, see ya. I'm calling the police right now. Okay, fine. I'll get out. But trust me, by the end of the day, we are going to be married. All right, whatever you say. See ya. And guys, honestly, if she comes back another time, I think I'm going to call the police. And speaking about calling people, I think I'm going to call my friend TV Man. And hello, TV Man. Oh, hey there, Speaker Man. What's up? Uh, can you come over? Because I need to talk to you about something. Oh, uh, yeah, sure. I'll be over there in a second. All right, thanks a lot. A few moments later. Hello, I'm here. Oh, okay, perfect. Hey, TV man. I have something super bad to talk about with you. All right, speaker man, you can tell me anything. All right, thanks a lot. Well, TV man, I have a crazy fair girl that wants to marry me. And she keeps coming to my house and is super duper creepy. Dude, you gotta do something about it. You can't let her marry you. Yeah, I know, but she said by the end of the day, she's gonna get me to marry her, so I'm actually super duper creeped out. There's no way that she's gonna marry you. Well, go to the police station and file a police report or something like that. Uh, do you really think I should file a police report? Uh, Okay, yeah. Well, thanks a lot, TV man. I'm actually gonna head to the police station right now, and I'm gonna do that. And, uh, hey, Mr. Policeman, I would like to file a police report. All right, what seems to be the issue? Well, I have a crazy fangirl, and she keeps stalking me, and she really, really, really wants me to marry her. All right, so you have a crazy fangirl, and she wants to marry you, and she's a stalker. Yep, that is correct. All right, I need you to tell me what she looks like. Oh, my gosh, Speaker Man, I know I can find you here. And this is her, Mr. Policeman. All right, man, I need you to stop being a crazy fangirl and a stalker, because you are under arrest. What? I'm under arrest? Yep, you sure are, because you want to marry this innocent man. But we are meant to be together. I just know it. Well, how do you know it if he doesn't even want to be with you? Come on, go to your jail cell. Okay. And now you can never marry me, crazy fangirl. Trust me, I'll find another way out of here so I can marry you. Well, there's actually no way for you to break out of this jail because it is super duper secure. And if you try marrying Speaker Man, then you are going to go back to jail. <sighs> okay, well, I guess I'll just go to bed then. Alright, and thank you so much, Mr. Police Man, for arresting her. Yep, no problem. She won't be bothering you anytime soon. Yeah, I really hope she doesn't. Well, see ya. Wait, what the heck? She literally just bought this whole entire truck to put a sign on that says, looking for Speaker Man. Are you serious right now? Well, what? 
whatever. I guess I have a new truck. And I'm gonna head straight back home. And finally, I'm back home. And now I can just go inside and I can chillax once and for all. Hey, speaker man, thank you for being my getaway driver. Wait, what the heck? How did you get out of jail? Well, I actually crawled through the vent and broke out of jail and then sat in my ice cream truck and lucky for me, you drove me home. Oh my goodness, crazy fangirl. You were in the ice cream truck. Are you serious? Yep, I sure was. Do you want some ice cream? No, I do not want any ice cream. I don't want anything from you. But wait, what if I told you we already have our wedding place set up? What the heck? You set up a wedding place for us already? Yes, it's so romantic and pretty. And I hired a priest to marry us. What are you serious right now? Well, tell them I'm not showing up. And you might as well just get rid of the whole entire thing. No, trust me. I'm going to get you to be there. Now, I'm going to take my ice cream truck and ride away. Okay, good. I don't want to see you ever again. Oh, I cannot believe that she hired a pastor to set up the whole entire wedding. Even though I'm not even going to get married to her. Well, guys, right now, I think I'm just going to go outside and run some errands. And hopefully, I don't bump into her. So, let's go to the grocery store. And what should I buy today? Let's see. Well, Doritos are my favorite. So, I think I'll just grab some of these. And yum, that is so delicious. And let me get some Reese's as well. And oh, look, a pizza. Don't mind if I do. And let's see. What beverage should I get? Oh, my gosh. Coca-Cola. I love Coca-Cola. And now that I have all my food, I can just buy it. Hey there, store worker. Oh, hello there. Do you want me to package your groceries? Yes, please. All right, here you go. Your total will be $50. Hey, what? $50? Okay, I cannot afford that. I'm sorry. See ya. Wait a second. Hey, get back here. Oh, my gosh, guys. I cannot believe that. I just had to rob that grocery store. Hey, get in the car. Wait, what the heck? Hey, crazy fanger, what are you doing? Get in the car, mister. No, I'm not gonna get in their car. And why do you have a white van? I said get in the car. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. Do not shoot me. I will get in your car. Thank you. Yep, no problem. Oh my gosh, guys. My crazy fanger literally just kidnapped me. I wonder what she's gonna do to me. This is so bad. Uh, so crazy fanger, where are we even going? We're going to get married. What? Get married? I do not want to get married to you. Come on. Come on, get out. Mister. No, I'm not gonna get out. I said get out. Okay, okay, I'll get out. I'm sorry. And priest, my husband has arrived. Oh, hello there, husband. Are you ready to get married? Honestly, Mr. Skippity Priest, I do not want to get married. I just got kidnapped and I got brought here. What? So you're not the husband? No, no, no. He is the husband. Come on, sweetie. Go next to the nice priest. No, I'm not gonna get anywhere near him. Yeah, come over here, husband. Honestly, guys, I'm just gonna get out of here. See ya. No, you aren't. Come back here. Okay, okay. I will go back. Oh my gosh, guys, what am I even supposed to do? She keeps pulling a gun on me, and I really do not want to get married to her. Well, come on now. Go ahead and stand next to me. Let's get married. Yay, I'm so excited. Uh, okay, Mr. Priest. All right, crazy fangirl, do you take Speaker Man as your husband? Yes, I do. All right, Speaker Man, do you take crazy fangirl as your wife? Uh, Say yes, sir, Alice. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, I do. All right, you guys are now officially married. You may now kiss. Yay, I've been waiting for this moment for so long. Wait, what? What kiss? Oh my gosh, okay, okay. I cannot kiss you. I'm gonna hop in that car. I'm gonna run you over. No, we are married. Come back here. No, you come back here. I'm gonna run you over. Oopsie daisy, I missed. Okay, okay. Let me try that again. Stand still this time so I can run you over. Come on, come on. Ah! And yes, I ran her over. Let's go. And phew, is she gone now? Let's see. Uh, hello, crazy finger. Are you here? Uh, crazy finger. Hello. And yes, guys. I am no longer married. Let's go. Hey, give me a kiss. What the heck?